I'm feeling a lot better than I did yesterday. My period, I'm on my period. Got a really bad belly ache, I had a really bad stomach ache, just aching all over, just feeling crap. So anyway, I'm still on my little PJs. I'm waiting for some parcels to come um, because I want to try some clothes on that I've got with you guys. Today I'm gonna clean, I'm gonna so we're gonna clean, we're gonna try some clothes on, I'm waiting for my new coat to come. Probably gonna just do like a face mask right now. I've got a complete bare skin, so I'm probably gonna do a bit of a face mask. Feed the animals. So Nala's food is in here. The food we get her is tails.com. Um I just find it easy. It gets delivered straight to my door. They do like proper sizes for her you put in like what dog breed it is and what she needs and stuff and like they will give you the exact size that she needs for measurement so she has two scoops anyway what do you think of my dressing gown it's so cute it's a little me to you dressing gown so the vitamins i take for my hair and my skin and my nails are something i was sent in a pl package it was in a vlog before these are the strawberry flavored gummies and I have two of these. I have one in the morning and I have one at night. I think these are really good. They taste really good. So I've just applied this <laughs> face mask. The one from Mask Time. I was expecting it to be blue but it's not. But um, guys, can you hear my cat? Snugs. Snugs. Snuggy. Meow. She's in proper heat right now. So, I've tidied my kitchen. I need to tackle the lounge next. Um, so I'm gonna go and do that. I'm gonna go and tidy my lounge. I'm gonna go and get everything sorted. And then my packages should be here by sort of one, half one. So it's about an hour, so we shall see when they arrive and I will come back on camera and show you everything that we got hi guys so I've just taken the mask off it's left my skin like really kind of soft which is good um yeah it's very soft I like that mask it feels like it was like a proper one of them moisturizing masks which I'm kind of glad I chose because I feel like that's really good for the winter um, I'm just trying to find my lip balm because my lips are suffering so bad. Now where did I put that lip balm? Oh my god, I don't know what to do for her. Yeah, I'm going to do a bit of kind of like a natural look today. So, um... I've just done a face mask, so I'm just going to use a bit of like primer spray, wet my face a little. Um, foundation, I'm, should I do my foundation first? No, I'm going to do my brows first. So for brows, I'm using my new Makeup Revolution kit. You guys know I love this. I've done a tutorial on it the other day. I really love it. I think it's one of the best brow palettes I've ever used because it is like what is that that I got there ignore that <laughs> snugs I, what can I do she's just laying there with her bum in the air crying making that noise snugs snugs what's up baby Nothing I can do, babe. Oh, poor thing. So, I'm going to use... Yeah, I really think this brow palette is, like, one of the best things ever because you get your, like, your wax and then you get your powder. Oh, ow. Bra your wax, your powder, your highlight, your base, everything. So, contour, concealer to carve it out. It's, it's just really good. So... 
I'm gonna go in with this now. Um, I'm just gonna do like a simple brow. Like I'm not gonna be mad. It's just because we're not going out. Actually, we are going out today. We are going out. We're doing a furniture shop. Well, I'm, I'm either gonna do it a furniture shop or go out for Christmas decorations. So I'm not gonna go mad. I'm not even gonna wear lashes. I'm just gonna do a simple look. Oh my God, snugs. What is up with you, babe? I honestly don't know what to do for her. Oh my god, oh my god, I hope she's not in pain. I've asked the vet like what I can do and they said there's nothing I can do. Um, except like sometimes get a hot water bottle and like try and get her to sit on that because it will relieve her a little bit. Oh, okay, we have some brows astray. I need to get rid of them right now. They're gonna bother me. Where are my tweezers? Snuggy, you're going crazy. I'm really sorry about the noise. It's weird, I know. But I have to keep an eye on her. Um, so, then I'm going to go in with this powder. If you want a full tutorial, I can link that one for you as well. Like, I'll just... I'll put it in the down bar. Down bar? Bottom bar? What is with my animals today? The tap's, like, dripping, so Cindy's up on there. What is going on today? I cannot cope. Right, then I'm going to take my dark powder and I'm going to go over my brows just to kind of set that wax in place. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab this concealer. I like the fact that this brow has that this brow palette has a concealer in it because then I haven't got to go and grab my own. So I'm going to grab a little bit of that concealer and I'm just going to kind of... conceal my brow. That'll do for the bottom. Then what I'm going to do is with this really nice colour, this is a highlighter, I'm going to grab the tiniest bit because this stuff is very pigmented. So I'm going to grab a little bit and I'm just going to highlight my brow. Okay. Now we're going to move on to the eyes. I'm going to be using my new Imag Imagination palette. Um, I'm going to be doing a full tutorial on some makeup looks with this. So make sure you keep an eye out on my beauty videos. I think it's going to be after Vlogmas because Vlogmas is just very intense with vlogs. And I can't really mix a tutorial in it completely, I don't think. I think it just completely vlogs. Um, so I'm going to just do a little look now with this palette. So I've only recently got this. <clears throat> this is the Makeup Revolution Imagination palette. I flip in, love this palette, I cannot wait to start using it. All I've done so far is swatched it. So here are the colours. I think the first colour I'm going to go in with is um, 
loving life this kind of neutral color and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a flat brush and I'm just gonna kind of set the base for my eyes so I'm just taking that across my lid and I'm gonna bring it all the way up as well that's just gonna kind of set everything in place and create like a nice kind of base for my eyes and then I'm gonna just kind of light that up a little bit because that turned out a little yellow so I'm gonna grab some of this Smashbox powder and I'm just gonna go over it real quick can you hear my tap dripping in the background so annoying and snugs in the background why are <laughs> what are this like why is everything so noisy in the background snugs all I did was say her name snugs oh it's when I say her name what the hell um okay so I'm gonna take a big blendy brush and the first color I'm gonna pick up I am gonna pick up the color pinky promise this kind of pinky nudey colour and I'm just going to start by working that in my crease just to create like a nice basic kind of creasy colour I'm going to go in with the colour Trying It, which is this kind of darky colour, and I'm going to pick some of that up, and I'm just going to go into my crease one more time, but just below my crease this time. like that then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab Berry Blast it's gonna be like a pinky look I'm gonna grab Berry Blast and I'm gonna apply that one on my outer corners just like that then what I'm gonna do <clears throat> is I'm gonna grab a little bit of concealer and I'm gonna basically just do like a half cut crease I'm gonna use the wand because we're running out of this it doesn't matter if it's not kind of neat because I'm gonna blend anyway but I'm going to create half a cut crease. I still need to get some cards, some Christmas cards for people. So now I've got that, I'm going to go in with a different brush. <clears throat> and I'm going to pick up the colour... Um, I'm going to pick up the colour Baby Girl first, this orangey colour, like orange shimmer, pretty, and I'm going to put that in the middle bit, just kind of work it in as much as possible. Are any of you guys like last minute shoppers or are you all done? I'm not last minute but <clears throat> I'm a very forgetful person and I always forget something. So I always like forget and then I realise right at the end of the last minute oh, 
which is not good, you know. Okay, then I'm going to go in with a different brush and I'm going to pick up the colour Raise and Praise. And I'm going to go from, kind of from just above my lid upwards. So I'm going to like draw a line as they say. Yeah, so I'm going to kind of just draw a line with that. I think this would look a lot better if we'd done lashes. But... I ain't got time for that right now. So I'm going to go in and do the same thing on this side. Just to kind of create a line, it's basically in the crease but it's a shimmer just like that then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with Forever Friend this pinky colour on the different side and I'm going to apply that in this inner corner here just where we haven't basically applied anything Okay, then right in the tear duct, I'm going to apply some Huns. There we go. So, back in with that big blendy brush, I'm going to grab Berry Blast again, that outer corner colour. And I'm just going to apply that on the outer corners. Slugs, babe, there's nothing I can do. You're too young to have a baby. Um, and then I'm going to go in with that small brush again and I'm going to grab some baby girl, that orangey shimmer. So then with a clean blending brush, with a clean brush, I'm just going to basically grab that first um, transition colour, the pinky promise, the nude colour, and I'm just going to blend it all in now. Just, just gently kind of make sure everything has blended all nicely. Like that. Then with that same colour I'm going to just take it underneath but just halfway. And then with Baby Girl, the orangey shimmer, I'm just going to take that in the middle. She's laying across the keyboard. I wish I could kind of show you guys. <laughs> Snugs, that was you. You sat on the keyboard. Oh my God. I was about to spin it around and show you guys, but she jumped down. Oh, give me strength. Um, anyway, so now I'm going to just go in with some mascara. I'm not going to do lashes. I'm just not today. I'm not feeling lashes. You know? So the mascara is <clears throat> W7 Eye Lust. It's actually a really good mascara. Oh my gosh, she's back on the lap computer again. I'm going to show you guys in a minute what she's doing. And I'm just going to do my top lashes as well, just so it looks a little bit more natural. I'm just feeling a bit of a natural lash today. Oh my god, let me show you. Get off babe! Let me show you what she's doing. She's crazy. She is freaking crazy, that cat. Okay, so now I'm going to move on to the face, because we are looking pale, we are looking a hot mess. Okay, so I've kind of primed earlier, I've done my face mask, I've cleansed and everything. 
So I'm going to, I'm not sure if I want to go in with the NARS or the Dream Satin Liquid. I think I'm going to go in with NARS because it just smells nice. And I'm feeling that kind of all day luminous glow. So with the Beauty Blender, I'm just going to apply, with this, I love this because I can literally apply three dots to my Beauty Blender and it will last the whole face. So one, two, three. So I just like to apply three dots. Oh my gosh, she's back up. And just apply it all over my face. And this will last my whole entire face. I love this foundation, it blends so seamlessly. It's just one of the best foundations I've ever tried. I do think I need the the the, um, the darker shade though, it is a little light for me. So I'm gonna try and get the darker shade. Snugs, please. I may have to shut her out in a minute because you guys can hear her really loud and it's just weird. I have very, very chirpy cats. Very. Cindy is very chirpy like. Someone commented that they could hear her the other day because she's just always chirping, always meowing, it's crazy. And Snugs is not really chirpy, she's chirpy but this is on another level, I've never ever heard her like this before. This is crazy. I've checked that she's not in pain so don't worry, like I've been to the vets, I've asked if she's in any pain, she's not, it's just that she's on her season and it's her way of kind of calling. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to tidy my eyes up like I want to make them look neater so I'm going to grab um, one of these brushes make sure there's no glitter on it and I'm going to just grab some of my concealer and I'm just going to kind of tidy my eyes up I like to use this for my eyes but I've literally run out so I'm gonna go in with some Clinique concealer this one is the Clinique all about eyes concealer so I'm gonna apply that a little bit on here I don't know what's going on but obviously I know that the packages and stuff are gonna get delayed because of Royal Mail but I've been waiting for something for a long time now and it's not here and I really want to try it on I can't wait, it's a coat I told you guys, I think I told you guys the other day that I've ordered one it's basically a teddy coat and I already have a teddy coat but it's um, a better one the one I have hardly fits me for one, it's also like a brownie colour, the one I have and I want the beigey kind of beigey colour the cream beigey colour so I'm hoping I like it. If I don't, then I'll just return it. Um, I don't know. It it looked okay on the pictures, but it also looked a little long. Um, the one I have right now finishes at my waist, so I wanted one that's a little bit longer, but this one looks very... What am I doing? I'm not even done my chin. <laughs> yeah, it's like crazy. I'm hoping that it looks really nice. Also, this concealer goes a long way. Like, I could literally make that last the whole freaking face. I also need to think about getting a new mattress. My mattress is so uncomfortable. Me and Liam are both so peed off with it. We haven't even had it that long, but it's just not comfy. Um, I think it's a... I think it's a pocket sprung one. So I'm going to try and get a memory foam mattress because I've heard they're really good. I think that's what my mum and her boyfriend have got. And they said, babe, there's nothing I can do. Why don't you come and sit with me? You 
keep coming over to me, babe. Oh, she's gripping me. I know, you keep coming over to me, but there's nothing I can do. Let me just sit with you. It's okay, mummy's here. I love you. I love you. I love you, Snugs. So, that's the concealer. I think now I'm going to kind of sit under my eyes. So, I'm going to use... Sit, just sit on my lap, hon. Or not. So, for sitting under my eyes, I'm going to use a Smashbox powder. And I'm going to use, like, um, this big kind of Real Techniques brush. And I'm just going to pop it under my, where I've just concealed. This is like a quick way of baking, like when I'm not going to bake and it's just like a bit of a natural look. I just like to use this and just kind of pop it on. Then what I'm going to do, just to make sure everything is kind of blended out, I'm going to go in with my Real Techniques um, stippling brush. <laughs> and, oh wow. Okay, it has glitter on it. Look at this now. Oh, freak. Freaking out. That's going to take forever to get off. Oh, it's just ruined all my makeup. Mm. I hate it when you do your makeup and that happens and you just get loads of glitter on your face. Do you know what? I'm just going to rock the glitter face. I'm not even bothered. This is crazy. I'm just going to take some foundation real quick and just go over it. Luckily, it's not like where I concealed. So we could kind of get that to work, I think. <sighs> I didn't realise this had glitter in it. Does it have glitter in it? Why did loads of glitter appear? Okay, we're going to try again. I've cleaned it now. So I'm just going to go... There we go. I'm just going to go over this and blend it all in. So it's all nice and blended. Then I am going to contour. So for a quick contour, I just use the I usually use the cream contour, but I'm just gonna do a quick contour with the shade and light palette. So with my shade and light palette from Kat Von D, I like to use the middle shade called Shadow Play. But as you can see, we don't have much left. So I'm gonna go in with the colour subconscious, which is this end one. I have to be careful with this though because it starts to give me a bit of a muddy look. Um, I don't know if it's the colour or something, but it just starts to give me a bit of a, a bit, a bit of a muddy look, you know. I'm just going to do a very light contour, to be honest. So this brush is PS Pro and it's basically shaped like this, it's from Primark, I saw it and I was like that is different, I'm going to try it. So it's shaped flat and then it goes up so this is like perfect for getting right into your contour, like that. I remember in Superdrug this lady literally, I was looking at some brushes, I was looking at this massive beauty blender that was like this but huge, it was by Real Techniques and this lady was like excuse me can you help me I'm trying to find a brush for contouring like to, to blend it out and I was helping her and I saw this and I was like you should try this but it wasn't PS Pro it was in Superdrug I can't remember the brand but um I said to her to try it because I literally picked this up the same day and I was like I'm gonna try this so this looks good so um because with this kind of thing especially a cream contour you need a quite a firm brush so obviously if you were to use that that wouldn't really work because it's quite flimsy but you would need like one of these kind of firm brushes where it's got like a bit of firmness to it and it will really get in there. So this is really firm so I'm going to try this and see how this goes. Oh, it feels really good. I like it. 
it really blends in nicely and naturally. It's not like too muddy or anything. I like this bit because I can use this on my nose. Yes, I love this brush because this is perfect for my nose. With my nose contour, I always pick up like a smaller brush, but this will work. Hello, Nala. She's gone ahead and took off her Christmas jumper. Not happy. So now I'm going to pick up some highlight. I'm not even going to... Oh, wait. We need bronze. Bronze, bronze, bronze. So for bronze, I'm going to use my all-time collection bronze in terracotta. I don't know what brush to use though, because I washed my brushes yesterday and they're all wet, so they're kind of like drying, but this could work. No, it's still too wet. I'm going to use this, see if this will work. I'm going to pick some up now. No, that's just for blending. What brush can I use for bronzer? I know, we'll just use this one. I love this bronze, it's so natural. What is going on? Nala, don't come in here and cause havoc. Mummy's filming. Go and look after your sister, she's going crazy right now. Where is she? It's gone quiet. So that's what I'm gonna do for my bronze. I'm just gonna blend it all in and I'm gonna go over with my stippling brush as well. This basically is a really good brush. I literally will use this for foundation if I have to or I just like this to kind of blend out any harsh lines so like when you've contoured or concealed or whatever it just blends it out without taking it all away it will just blend it all nicely so for highlight I'm going to be using the PS Luna Glow palette because I really love this palette um, I don't exactly know the one it's called it's just highlighter palette um, and I'm going to be using the colour Backlight. I really love this colour here. So I'm going to pick up my Unicorn Cosmetics brush. I'm going to pick some of that product up and I'm going to see how it goes with this look. It's a very greeny look, but it looks good. Like, it just looks like fairy time. It literally, I feel like a fairy with this highlight on. I'm going to apply a little bit on my nose and then on my cupid's bow. Perfect. Okay. So, that is kind of the look I'm going for. Um, we just need something for lips. Do you know what, guys? <coughs> Hi, babies. So, where I may have just been, I'm sure you've heard. I'm always filming when they come and then they make that horrible noise, they buzz me and then Nala goes off on one. Anyway, I'm going to just light this candle back up because it went out. No, it didn't. I blew it out. And we are going to open packages. There we go. Set the ambience. So this, is the this was the makeup look that we just done. Pretty... Just, I'm not going to do lashes or anything. That is just it. And then I'm just going to be like trying stuff on. So, Okay, so we have quite a lot of packages. As you can see, we have quite a few. A shoe. Why do I have a shoe? Oh my god. This is hilarious. I know exactly what this is. I sold something on Depop and it was a pair of shoes. I sent her the shoes, but I sent her two different shoes, like not two different um, feet, like it, not two different like different feet, it was two different shoes, like I sent one from one brand and another from another brand and they look identical but I felt so bad so she sent me the other shoe back, bless her heart. It's a heel, um, it's just like a black heel. Let me show you guys. I'm hoping my coat is in this lot. Wow, she has wrapped this up. Good and proper. Jeez. Liam's on his way home now. So I'm hoping we have some of my clothes. Then we can get dressed and go shopping. If he wants to, that is. I didn't even ask him. I asked him the other day and he wanted to. 
and then we ended up like getting other stuff done oh my god another bag so in a bag in another bag wow girl you know how to wrap your shit in another bag so this is a shoe it's so funny i sent this one's from primark and i sent a, a primark one and i think it was an oasis one or something and she sent me the one back so i sent her the other one back do you get me so i have my shoe back i know stupid right i think this is a chocolate palette i'm super excited i've ordered quite a few um so i'm hoping these i think i can just fill one i'm hoping that we have oh no it is a chocolate palette what it's a revolution it's a soap palette so this one is the basic soap palette um i've also got the extra spice one coming as well i just can't wait for i'm gonna be showing you guys but this is the soap palette um i'm super excited love it i think we've lost the color in transit but it'll be okay so this is the basic one. I've got the extra spice coming, so I'm super excited. But when Vlogmas is over, and during Vlogmas as well, I'm going to be doing little tutorials. But when Vlogmas is over, we're going to go back in with full-on eye makeup tutorials on palettes for Makeup Revolution. Because you know I love Makeup Revolution. It's pretty pink packaging. I think this is going to be the hoodies. I'm hoping it's the hoodies. It's the hoodies. So I'm going to try these on. So y'all don't worry, you're going to see what they look like. Um, these are in a size, uh, I got I got it in a size 16. Just because with my condition I fluctuate weight. So there's no point in me getting what I am right now, which is like a 14. Because in a few months I'll be a 16. I fluctuate, so I feel like it's always good to have bigger than small. So I went and got this in a 16. So this is basically a grey cropped hoodie. So you can see, pretty, it's the same but pink, but a little bit of a different material, this is more of a warmer material, and this one is in a size 14. So this is a hoodie as well, cropped hoodie, can you guys see, and it's just got the hood bit. So this is my original teddy coat. So I'm going to show you how it fits and then you'll kind of understand. This one is like really kind of, I do like it. This one's like puffy, very kind of puffy on the arms, very big looking. But if you can see the waist, excuse my PJs, but if you can see the waist, it finishes here and it kind of like bends outwards and I don't like that. From Primark guys, ah, oh, this feels better. This feels more kind of fitted for me, like it feels looser. It feels a lot flipping better. I'm going to go and show you guys in the mirror. See what we think. I love the colour. Do you, do you see what I mean by the colour? Like it's so different compared to the other one. Let me just pop the light on. So excuse the PJs and the slippers. But this is the... This is the teddy coat now. So... It does run a bit big on me, I must admit. Like, it looks quite big on me. I don't know if you can see, but I like it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, like, put a hoodie on and see how it fits, see how it goes. But I think it's really nice. I actually like the length of it as well. It fits nicely, really nicely. Um, it's also got a zip on. The other one had a zip, but it didn't seem to zip up. Not because of, like, it was too small, but it was. But I've got a lot more room in this one. Um, I like this. I think this is going to be better for me. I definitely think this one's going to be better for me. Yeah, I'll try and show you guys as much as I can. So this is like the sleeves. So you can see the sleeves aren't the same as the other one. The other one was really kind of bulky and like baggy. So I think I'm going to like this. And I do much prefer this colour. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go and get dressed. I'm going to try these hoodies on. And I'm going to show you guys. You know what guys, I actually really love this hoodie. I really like it. it's Nala Liam's home it's really baggy and that's what I want I want it to be kind of baggy and a bit loose it fits really nice on my kind of stomach as well like it's a nice fit it's not too much no. hi I know she's a little sod what's she barking at? You, she could hear you close the door. 
in the car. So yeah, this runs like nice, it fits nice. It's not too tight and I also kind of love these little bits, the drawstrings and stuff. So I'm really happy with this one. It was really good. So let's see what this coat's like. So it's definitely, I, I like the colour, like I said. I much prefer the colour than the other one. It's more of like a beigey kind of colour. And it feels a lot more warmer than the other one as well. I like it. So... I'm happy with my coat. Cindy. Hey, baby. I know. This is what she's doing, look. Good girl. Yay. Hey, baby. <coughs> yeah. Mm. So tomorrow, um, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to end the vlog here and I'm going to go and edit it so it's up for tonight and tomorrow we're going to go to Ikea and we're going to do a little bit of shopping, not shopping but like furniture shopping, having a look what we need um, and I don't know what else we're doing tomorrow but make sure that you're subscribed and you're here for tomorrow's Vlogmas. I hope you really enjoyed day three and four of Vlogmas because like I said I'm compiling yesterday's vlog with this one because I missed yesterday so I'm really sorry we're back on normal schedule and see you tomorrow bye